There's nothing quite like the holidays. It's the perfect excuse to round the family up and spend some quality time together. Like Thanksgiving. I used to love Thanksgiving. This pan's so big, I bet I could fit you in it. <laughs> these? They're Cornish game hens. Well, they were a week old, so I got them for under two bucks. We still have Christmas. My name is Lynn, and I'm married to Mort, the cheapest bastard alive. He owns a company called the Weeblow Hair Dryer Plant. You'd swear the guy's on welfare. Sir. He fights Sir, I... for every penny he has. 50 cents? Are you nuts? Look at this he doesn't care who knows about it. And he'll sell it to me for the price I want. I'm in manufacturing. I know how this works. You, hey, get your hands up. Front yard. What do you think? On Christmas Eve, I was at my wit's end. I was hoping he'd surprise me. This wrapping is beautiful. Yeah, that's what you said last year. It's only the best hair dryer money can buy. It's the Weeblo 3600. It turns popsicles to water in 10 seconds. A man that cheap shouldn't live to see Christmas morning. I just needed a way to get rid of him. Those things broke already? God, a half a buck doesn't buy a damn thing these days. When the lights didn't work, I figured his fate would have to wait until Christmas morning. Well, here she is. She's six feet tall, and, well, we won't have any needle mess. Daddy, I thought we were going to have a big, beautiful tree this year. Well, we do. One out in the front yard. I decided Christmas Day would be the last day Angela and I would be cursed with such a cheap man. Honey, don't you want some eggnog after bringing in that big tree? You know, Mom and Dad are going to be over tonight. Well, they're going to drink a lot of eggnog, and I, I really would rather not have to buy any more. I was a sip away from salvation. He didn't take it. Hi, honey. What's up? Daddy's making brunch. No, don't tell me this isn't good food. 
This was a centerpiece to one of America's first diets. Lord, you are so cheap. Will you ever spend any money? No, Lynn, I won't. I don't want to part with my hard-earned money, and I don't plan on starting any time soon. So give it a goddamn rest! Brunch was the last straw. What is that? No, 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 no! I wanted a fucking cell phone. the ways to lose your husband. He slips in a tub and electrocutes himself. Bye, Daddy. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! Merry Christmas, guys. Come on in. Can I get you some eggnog? <laughs> 